I just got to share this with you guys. I haven't shared the mod page with you guys, so I was having a look at it and I want to share with you guys, look how much this mod has to offer. In my past, I don't know, half dozen videos I've done playing this uh, 1862 campaign. We're still in 1862 and we are headed to Sharpsburg, uh, Antietam. See, I gave it a 10. Rock and roll. So check it out, you guys. Besides the uh, new battlefields, Gettysburg, I was impressed. So yeah, the uh, Evergreen Cemetery Gatehouse, you guys, I'll take you there. We'll go there on a little video tour. And that back here is where the witness tree is, was, and it died on us almost 10 years ago. But anyway, you guys, this is, this is my neighborhood. You can see the cupola right out my window. So that's where I live. This is great. So I was tickled when I saw this. This is really cool. Right. So we got this is kind of the view from my the direction that I'm facing. This is what you would see in the screenshot where I'm sitting right now. This is Lincoln Highway, Chambersburg Road. The seminary is right there. So this would be my view from where, where we're sitting right now in 1863. So well done. This is fun. This is great. Nice. Cemetery Hill. This is cool. And Shepherdstown. Awesome. Check it out, you guys. Look how much you guys have put so much work into this. Into the writing and the dialogues. Thank you. Well done. I've been sitting here reading for about the past hour. And so I decided to record a quick video, but check it out. Cement Mill. Nice. Look at this, you guys. <laughs> well done. Look at everything you guys have put into this. Sam Watkins, man, Company H, best book. Best book ever. There were 40,000 books written about the Civil War 20 years ago. It's probably twice that now. So, on that note, that many books written on the Civil War, several people, and just recently a few people, uh, hit me up and said you know if there was any book that I would suggest what would I suggest and that would be Sam Watkins Company H number one if you wanted to learn Sam Watkins Company H if you wanted to learn about specific things for example Gettysburg the peach orchard or Pickett's Charge I would su highly suggest my friend James Hessler and if you guys have ever watched the History Channel you've seen James on TV I would definitely suggest his book on Pickett's Charge sorry it's flipped and his book on the Peach Orchard if you're interested in learning a great deal about those engagements in a very very entertaining and very warm and well presented format the books are a pleasure to behold they are so those are two good books but they're not your typical boring dry black and white reads these books are a pleasure to just flip through so James does some good books on those those things but in any event guys back to the mod so I was looking through the mod page and thought I'd share so look at how much they put into this Look how much they put into this. Well done, you guys. Well done. Yep, Kennesaw Mountain. This is great. This is good stuff. We are going to have fun with this, for sure. And I've been dying to do some living history and some reenacting, so I'm hoping I can get out if anything is going to be going on in Gettysburg the rest of the year. Slim chance. I couldn't get out. I couldn't get out for the third or fourth. The first and second took too much out of me and finding a ride with Slim Pickens. Philly, look how big it is. Check it out. There's no cheesesteak shop, though. I went in there. They don't have any cheesesteaks. But yeah, this is bitching. I still couldn't figure out how to get into the dungeon to rescue Braxton Bragg. Check it out, you guys. Look at all the interiors, everything. We haven't even scratched the surface yet. Jeff Davis, I was in the Jeff Davis Guards. Nice, well done you guys. Look at New Orleans, awesome. So much to explore, and these guys are just getting started. So thanks Fredericksburg, thanks for the uh, 
the time you guys put into this mod. Fredericksburg and Gods and Generals, that scene was actually filmed in Harper's Ferry. And I'm still shooting to move to Harper's Ferry. One issue though is Harper's Ferry is hillier. And now I'm, I'll be in a wheelchair more and more as I get older. Nashville, bitchin'. And you guys, King, thanks for sending me the super nice messages that you did. First Tennessee rock and roll, check them out. Bitchin', that's what I was talking about with my black trousers. Okay, I've already got the pattern for my daughter to make me my jacket. It's just finding good fabrics for the jacket. Hat, already got it. Cool beans. And then we'll get, we'll hand sew ourselves a uh, banner. Nice, the Zouaves kick ass, Maynards, Hawkins. I'd love to have a Hawkin, like a real Hawkin. Yep, I got Hardee's, that there. Nice kick ass. That's such a nice hat. That is a nice hat. <laughs> well done. Sitting right back there. Yep, that's what my hat will turn into. My black one. Sitting there behind me on the couch. I don't know if you can see it. Nice. Well done, you guys. Well done. Look at Birdside sitting there on his ass. Well done, you guys. Excellent. Creating and editing videos. Maybe I'll sign up, guys. You guys are looking for a video editor. Feel free to share my stuff. Check it out. Rock and roll, you guys. So come play. Come play, all my friends. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's get some... Oh, you guys. Let's get some multiplayer skirmishes going on. Rock and roll. So, you guys, please keep, ro keep, please keep rolling on this right on I played the original all right I played the original years ago years ago it's probably I realized today at like the 150th anniversary of Gettysburg and I was like wanting to play some Civil War but I love the Warband game format and I have for 10 years since I picked up the box with the CD but well done you guys well done well done well done you guys got a 10 you guys got a 10 from me for sure. Rock and roll. So, adios muchachos. You guys have a super safe, awesome, healthy, and successful day today wherever you may roam. All my friends everywhere. So stay tuned, you guys. We're going to have some fun with this mod. Multiplayer skirmishes. Bitchin' bitchin'. Have a good one, y'all. Hope there's some history in your day.
They made it all the way to the, uh, the Bryan Farm, the 11th Mississippi, during Pickett's Charge, made it all the way to the Bryan Farm. When you stand there and you look at it and you're sitting up there on Cemetery Ridge and you're looking at the Bryan Farm, the position of the 26th North Carolina, Armistead's Brigade, the 57th Virginia, it's pretty contestable about who got furthest. From my opinion, from what I'm looking at, the 11th Mississippi got furthest. That's the Bryan Farms pushed way up back, but that's just from my point of view from where I've stood around the Gettysburg Battlefield, 11th Mississippi. Hell yeah. Oh, you're going to the slammer. Curse this day. I need some backy. Oh, you're going to the slammer, OC Ord. The Orphan Brigade is on the move with the Army of Tennessee. I love Van Doren's flag. Van Doren's flag, this design, was one of the original proposed flags for the entire Confederacy at the beginning of the war. There were several designs a lot like that. It's a great banner. Great banner. You guys ever seen the Ewers Brothers play Second South Carolina String Band? Probably at the 147. These guys live. They're awesome live, super friendly guys. And our adventure will continue. I can smell those black beans in there. Just before the battle, the general hears around. He says the Yanks are coming. I hear their right. And as always, my friends, thanks for tuning in. And I hope you guys have a happy, healthy, and successful day tomorrow ahead, wherever you may roam. Kentucky Coffee Tree, over and out.